Hey there, everybody. What's going on? Welcome back to the channel. I'm Lucky, and we've got more Dragon's Dogma Dark Arisen. We were rolling around Grand Soren last episode, just kind of parkouring up there on the walls and exploring stuff and finding treasure chests. <clears throat> Made my way down here, spent the night at the end, recovered. And we're going to get on with a couple of quests. I'm kind of interested in what a few of these weapons are. This Gleam of Heaven, I don't know what that is. Whether it's a ring, a weapon, some kind of <clears throat> potion. Um, but we're going to go get this by defeating ten phantasms. Perhaps the rage that animates those fell creatures takes hold of their victims. So I think we have to go to the Water God's Temple. Soul Flare Canyon. So let's see if we can travel right up there. And go see if we can do that really quick. And then we'll continue with some main quest stuff. So far, the game is just excellent, guys. Where is Soul Flare Canyon? It's up north. It's one of those two spots right there. So we'll go up here to Hill, Hill Figure Knoll. Ah, just got off of work. A little bit stiff. A long day today. Oh, man. Feels good to be home playing some games, I'll tell you that. Oh, hope you guys had a good day and are having a good week. There's something drawn on the hill. We're getting real excited for Dragon's Dogma 2 coming out here. Oh, put my headphones in, we'll get rocking and rolling. I love our, <clears throat> our fighter here who looks like a Crucible Knight, Gore. He looks so cool. I love the way they designed that. So anyways, we better... Uh, We do have it active. Now, Soul Flayer Canyon is going to be, I believe, all the way over here. If we just follow this ridge line all the way down here, it should lead us right to Soul Flayer Canyon East Entrance. Wish I had one more port crystal. I'm still not going to pick that one up at Hill Figure. No, I'm going to leave it there because I think we have to go back to Blue Moon Tower eventually. Yes, 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 no harpies, we know. I'm not really want to fight those right now. Uh huh. The fall damage, of course. Ah! Those guys all just spawn. Whoa, I think I'm gonna switch back to the scolding razors. Oh, I'm on fire from them, it's not actually a power. My bad. This guy's strong. Where'd he go? Boom, he's right there. Oh, we get up, Danielle. Be wary. Got him. We have triumphed. Strength in numbers arisen. Enough of you fooling around. So I think the catacombs is up there. I think we want to go farther south. Let's move our waypoint right there. There we go. If they won't give us one, we'll give ourselves one. This cold is a far cry from Cassidus's climb. You guys do whatever you want. We'll keep running. Running, running, running. <laughs> Muad Deep, he's with me. Did you guys see the trailer for the Dune MMO that's coming out? It looked pretty sick, man. God. That's one of my favorite series of all time. I love those books. Hmm. What's going on over there? It's so cool watching that come down from the sky. Wow. That move is epic. You know they're gonna have some just absolutely unbelievable spells in the new Dragon's Dogma. I hear Ort moving about the wood. Dios Hills. And we found a magic spring. I don't know if we knew this existed here. Ah, it's so nice. 
This spring will ease our weariness. Yep, <clears throat> sure was, or sure did. Oh, there's an ogre up there. It is massive, and it blinds us to what lies beyond. That guy's doing. A goblin. Play him on. Every blow is dead. Be careful. Oh god. Come on. We'll take him out. I don't really want to do that. I don't want to use it. I like how we can just sit on him and light him on fire like this. Isn't that so cool? We're just gonna whack him from behind and keep lighting him on fire. Oh, I know my fire's gone. See his eyes are red? Or his eyes red? Oh. Whoops, I don't want to use two of those. Shoot with that arrow. Oh, I got a goblin with that arrow. Blow him up. Alright, play him on. I don't know why my guys are not really attacking. It's like, come on, get in there. I know we changed the location for Muad'Dib, our main pond, and now he's a mage, but come on, get up in there. Keep sticking them in the side here. There you go. That poisonous belt is a killer. Look at it. It's just sucking us all the way. There we go. Whoops. Oh, that's not the right one. Wait, am I out of... No, it's right up here. Thought I was out of potent green wars for a minute there, but I was actually just looking at the wrong part of my inventory. To Soul Flare Canyon we go. <laughs> Stop giving stuff to Lua Deeb. He doesn't need any of it. Not like we do. <clears throat> so yeah, I'll, I'll probably play that Dune MMO. I don't think I've ever played a, a real MMO before. Um, I played World of Warcraft back when it was just on PC offline. I played World of Warcraft number two, Man vs. Orc or something like that. I can't remember. But that was the only one of those I ever played. I've never done any of the... Well, I guess Halo. But that wasn't the same thing. That was... A little bit different. A little bit of Call of Duty. Hmm. You might find all of use here, Master. I suggest we search. But when that Dune game comes out, you bet your ass one for that. This looks interesting. Tagilius Malice. What the hell? Oh, Tagilius Miracle. A medicine favored by the renowned gladiator Tagilius. Use it to boost strength for a time. Okay, cool. Makes us stronger. Scarlet and Angelica back there. I don't know what to do with that. Take them down. Yeah. Uh-huh. 
Now oh, we're almost there. We're just gonna keep on it. Oh, I didn't want to eat that. Damn it. We don't take time to do this. Don't want any trouble, ladies. We're just going to keep mosing. Wood. Okay, we don't want to fight that guy. Let's keep going here. Well, either way, we're just gonna go right past him. Oh! No, I'm not. I'm gonna keep wandering here. Up into Soflea Canyon. No, we don't want to slay them. Come on, let's go. They hold the advantage. No time for that. We gotta get ten phantasms here. Come on, Gore. Yeah, we go all the way around and then up there. Da, da, da. Well, it was a giant ogre. We just saw him. Don't take kindly to trespasses. Oh, well, get the hell out of my way. We don't take kindly to trespassers. Uh oh. These guys are tough up here. Okay, I'm gonna switch back to my scalding razors. Chunk of her health. You. Oh God. Okay. Oh. Hello. What's up, buddy? There you go. We got a roll and it's on fire. Gonna, it's actually pretty tough. You <clears throat> gotta cast your spell or what? Oh yeah, he's dead now. That tornado spell combined with my fire. He's dead. Look at, look at how fast that killed him. I mean, magic is unbelievably overpowered in this game. That, that killed him just like that. Which is cool because we needed to combine three chimeras anyways. It's one of our quests. Freakish claw, freakish mane. Uh huh. Yeah, if you can get the cast time for that spell. Man. Whoever did this may still be near. I mean, are we there yet? Yeah, it's right over here. They're armed, Master. Who cares there, Muadib? I thought I was gonna get hurt. There, a cave entrance. There, a chest. This looks interesting. Nope, trouble. I know where that is at all times. <clears throat> we have a long standing relationship. Hmm. This canyon links the capital with the west of Grancis. So where are the phantasms at? It's awesome, we can knock them right, right off the edge and into the chasm right there, watch. Boom, falls right down. What? What? You guys... Oh, whatever? We have triumphed. Yep, we sure did triumph. We triumphed. 
Then we go down here and maybe find a couple like of phantasms. <laughs> Scarlet Cape. Oh. I don't know if I got that last time. I'm surprised none of them picked it up. <clears throat> I wonder if they're random drops. I'm actually not sure. Oh gosh. Those things are worth a lot of experience. Oh my god, no. It's funny how anytime you really fall off an edge, you're not supposed to, it's just into water and it brings you right back. I don't know if I've ever really fallen to my death without. Oh, here they are. Here's some fantastic right here. Without hitting something on the way down, you know, like a fall damage, basically. We need magic to build. Whoa, something really hurt me. Got you. Come on. What the hell? Why is it not shooting? There you go, got him there. What the hell? It's so weird how that works with them sometimes, I don't know. That's one of the only moves I got. <laughs> you summon that big old thing against him, huh? Holy cow! Aspen sight, I like that. So, so those are the phantasms it's talking about, right? Yeah, we got two out of them. Two out of ten. Let's see how many we can get in this run. We might have to make two runs at it here. Hello. Arrows in the dark. Strength in number. We have triumphed. You too. Doesn't matter, they all fall the same. I have it! Ooh. Giant coin pouch, very good. Couple of mushrooms. Can always use a couple more mushrooms. Rusted arch staff. Where the hell did you even find that? Gosh. There's just like stuff always laying on the ground that I miss like that. Now honestly, the better one seems to be. It draws the light from its own. Oh yeah, that one instantly kills him. No way. You see that? Watch that. Because it does light damage too, that's unbelievably good. Astrocytes, what we get from them. So now we've got four of them down. Do not let them close. I didn't. Pressure, perhaps. I destroyed them. Raptor Curus. Okay, so it's randomly generated stuff inside these treasure chests, guys. Now I don't know if all the loot is dungeon specific. Oh, and we can even wear them. And they're actually not bad. Not great, but not bad. The Raptor Curus. Quesis, excuse me. Armor inspired by birds of prey and specifically designed to allow maximum range of movement. Huh. Okay. Versus my chainmail skirt. What's the. How do they look? They look sick. Little birds of prey things. We're going to use them anyways. I don't care if they're any better or not. And the Scarlet Cape. Really cool looking. One minus, one minus, three minus. Eh, it's not as good. Or as cool looking. K 
keep the one we got. I've been drenched. Well, quit rolling in the water. This treasure chest all over in this game. Lightning courses through them. Where? A simple oh. touch can save. Oops. Watch this at one shot of him. Here we go. Boom. One shot. So that's five of them. I wonder if we hang out here long enough, they'll just keep respawning. I'm just gonna put around here for another couple minutes and we'll find out. So we got the Dune MMO coming out. We've got Dragon's Dogma 2 at the end of this month. We have Elden Ring, Shadow of the Urge, we're coming in June. And of course, everybody else is going to be following and <clears throat> making their own videos and everything like this. I'm going to go check out a ton of the people that I like to follow on YouTube and watch a ton of their videos. You guys should go check out anybody you like, too. It's going to be a ton of content coming out this year. Let's throw his barrel off. Ah! That didn't make it down very far. What game are you guys most excited about this year? Here we're already into March. We got two months down. Almost a quarter of the year down so far, so we've heard a lot of announcements, had some things come out. What's been your favorite game so far and what game are you most looking forward to? I would say the game I'm most looking forward to is Dragon's Dogma 2, although Shadow of the Earth Tree DLC is close second. And I only don't consider that number one because <clears throat> There's no way it's going to be better than Elden Ring, the game. Um, and so I'm going to put Dragon's Dogma 2 in front of that. Also, a full-fledged game gets a higher ranking than a DLC. I don't know. I don't really see anybody else here. Or any other phantasms coming here. An intricate carving of a lovely goddess infused with the power of fire. Wait, why am I... Oh yeah, because you could throw it, I guess, right? Add some oil to that. Okay, let's continue on with our journey and see if we can find any more. I was wondering why I couldn't. You guys take care of those harpies. No! Hey, the hell? Let him go. I'll draw its attention. Well, I guess you can't do much, you're a warrior. Got him. On solid ground, the advantage is ours. No, my fire is yours. Strength in numbers, Arisen. Now hold on a minute. Did I just see? That there's a place we can jump over here. I didn't even do it before. Interesting. Very interesting. Where does this lead? Oh, we've been here before. Leaper's Ledge. We know all about Leaper's Ledge. This was kind of the boss area down here. Yeah, what's in this chest now? And a mystic robe. A simple robe worn by shamans who commune with nature. Yeah, your magic goes up, your defense goes down, a whole bunch of magical attributes. It looks really cool. I like that look. <clears throat> We're more of an archer warrior though. I'm not quite sure I want to commit to full robes. Master's bracers. Everything goes down. Except a couple of abilities. Gloves of quality leather trusted by a seasoned adventurer. They sure look cool. Now, Leaper's Ledge. Don't be leaping off the ledge, guys. Stop. Large coin pouch, always welcome.
giant coin pouch. Holy cow. There's so much stuff in this whole dungeon here. I think there's something over here, too. Yep. The triple tooth. We already have one of those. I would have to say the Strider, <clears throat> Magic Archer, is my favorite character I've played so far. I played the Fighter and the Mystic Knight the first time through. We've been the Ranger and the Magic... No, we've been the Strider and the Magic Archer now. And I love both these ones. The moveset's cool. There's enough damage and enough um, <clears throat> variety to make it fun and interesting. And that double jump, I'm going to say it the entire time I use it, is so cool. It's just enough to make a difference. But not enough to be, like, stupid. You know what I mean? Tasteful, I guess I'll say. It's a tasteful double jump. Hey, Spidey. My Spidey sense was tingling. Oh, get out of the way! Oh, this one. Lots of coin pouches. Snow hobby. Where? It takes fire. We have triumphed. Oh, that was an ogre up there. I hit. on another character and I can still see my character fighting. Uh-oh. Got a little bit, a little bit tight right there for a minute. All of a sudden it was a crowded intersection. Too many yahoos in one place. I'll take that. We'll get up to you, don't worry, we're coming. The air is chill. I think this was the other way out. Yeah, that's the other way out. Fall from these heights will shorten a leg. Oh god. This looks interesting. What am I doing? I'll draw its attention. I hit one. Hope it falls. Yes, it did. Gotta get him while they're over the ledge. Oh, he fell. You're lucky. Rain steel upon it! I'm coming. I'll provoke it. Man, those arrows don't do any damage to it. I wonder why that is. Oh, 
strength in numbers arisen. Hmm. I don't know if we're gonna get any more phantasms, guys, in this run. I can't can't remember if there's any more. Might have to go outside, and come back. This looks interesting. Evil Eye, strategy two. So let's use the Chimera strategy. Oh, our party already has this knowledge. Your pawns have gained knowledge. Okay. I've gained I've some learned the contents of this book. I missed it over here. Something else that I didn't get last time. Liberating brew. A light cure. Those are always nice for magical debilitations. Oh, there's a treasure chest all the way over there. How I get to that one? I don't know. Hello? Is anybody here? Oh, this is the very beginning. Okay. Well, we might as well leave and come back because it seems like to all the fantastics for now. But at least we can get five in one run, so we'll just take two runs through here. But I don't know how long it's going to take these guys to respawn. It might take them like a week or something. I'm pretty sure that it's not going to be an instant respawn. But we'll go back in here and check. This canyon links the capital with the west of Ramses. Oh yeah, cool. These guys respawn, so. Whoa, hello. Anyways, this guy confused. These guys. There you are. You guys deal with those guys. I'm gonna come down here. Come after these phantasms here. Ooh, that was a mistake to come all the way down here like this. Come on. Come on. One, two, got them both. Look at that. Boom. Oh, that one did. didn't work on that one. Come on. There you go. Must not have been a direct hit last time. Provoking what? Oh, the heart? Man, Gore was on top of it. I had my back. It was coming for me. I have it! Well, there you go. I love her outfit. Ah, she's Finish. dead now. Good, good. We have triumphed. We sure have. Ah, come on! This ends it. I'm gonna get all three guys even do anything here. Maybe not. I spoke too soon. Goblins hate fire. <laughs> We have triumphed. Here, little phantasm. Yeah. Nothing? 
Maybe it's just that first section that keeps spawning. White wine, a sweet white liquor made with whole fruits. Its soft flavor soothes the senses. Interesting. Um, okay. Master, a snow hawk! Crank it! Quit in the lights! Well, yeah. Let's just go back to this front entrance, since that phantasm isn't down here, because this is the only other spot they were. Oh, can we not go? Back up there now? There we can, let's go this way. I think. Gotta fight these Saurians, but who cares? Oh, they're not here. Malignants, that sounds sick. For the warrior only. A saw-like longsword infused with cold such that it freezes as it eviscerates. Its iced enchantment is internal. Nice, that's a badass sword. And we saw that on one of the fighters we... <clears throat> one of the pawns we had earlier. Okay, guys. We're going to beat these harpies and we're going to end the episode right here. When we come back, we'll continue on with trying to score the gleam of heaven. Oh, there we go. Oh my god. Drawing meteors down into the canyon. Don't do not don't, don't do that. I'm getting away from you guys. That's too crazy for me. You're too cray cray. Alright guys. Thanks for watching the channel. We'll see you guys in the next episode. We'll continue looking for the gleam of heaven. Every time I turn around, there's one of these damn harpies. Later.